वेलकम टू सिंपली लॉजिकल दिस इज वेंकटेश हाउ कैन आई गेट द आंसर 24 फोर बाई ओनली यूजिंग द नंबर्स एट एट थ्री एंड थ्री यू कैन यूज एड सप्रैक्ट मल्टीप्लाई डिवाइड एंड पैरेंथसिस इन ऑर्डर टू अचीव दिस नोट यूर यू मस्ट यूज टू एट एंड टू थ्रीज टू अचीव द सोल्यूशन Pause the video and try yourself before checking the solution. If you are new to the channel, subscribe to the channel to get updates about our new videos. Let's check the solution now. Since the condition says that you must use add, subtract, multiply, divide and parenthesis, the problem becomes hard. If additional rules also allowed like logarithm, factorial sign roots, then it becomes easy to solve the problem. do share the answer in the comment section if you could able to solve using any of the bonus mathematical operations such as logarithms factorials and roots since rules are very strict here it becomes one of the hardest problems to solve the trickiest part of this problem was getting around using parentheses the clever way to do this is to implement division as a fraction bar which implies grouping thus no need for parenthesis you probably haven't worked with that format for a while it's something you see in elementary school and not much afterwards which is what makes this problem so tricky what helps the most in solving this problem was realizing that 8 divided by 1 by 3 equals 24 Then all we need is to figure out how to use the remaining eight, three, and three to obtain one by three, since one eight is already used in the numerator. So this is a much simpler task. This is the solution for this particular puzzle. So this is how you can actually achieve one by three in the denominator. I will prove how this works. So begin by rewriting three as three by one, and then make a common denominator. So what I am trying to do now is I am trying to uh, simplify the denominator so that I can prove one by three very easily. What I am trying to do is I am rewriting three as three by one, and then make a common denominator. The common denominator will be three. So multiply three by one by three by three to obtain nine by three. I have done this to simplify the calculation. Note nine by three is an equivalent fraction to three by one, or because nine by three is equal to three, which we have represented earlier as three by one. So now the equation is eight divided by nine by three minus eight by three. Now we can subtract the two fractions since the denominator is same. So this will yield eight divided by one by three. This is what we are trying to obtain. Finally, divide eight by one by three. To do so, multiply by the reciprocal of one by three. Lastly, multiply straight across to yield twenty-four. This is the solution for one of the hardest math puzzles. So finally, the solution is eight divided by three minus eight by three, which will yield twenty-four. The solution is hard for two reasons. First, it requires two divisions and fractions. Second, it is the only solution out of all possible combinations. That's all for this video. Hit a thumbs up if it found useful for you. Thanks for watching. Let's meet in the next video with one more interesting problem. Thank you.